Hello everybody. Just thought I'd give you guys a quick update on what is going on. <laughs> Can you figure out what's going on? <laughs> I have completed my move and this is my new home. <sighs> yeah. You can see good enough there. They're still in process of moving it in. Um, I basically moved to like a campground that's situated with a um, scrapyard, which is kind of good, kind of bad. It's, it's really not the most um, fabulous views, but um, the owner said I can pull components. <laughs> So I'm gonna take full advantage of being here to pull like um like right now I'm in process of um pulling this stuff the um the ladder thingy I'm trying to get one that's not broken I got one that wasn't broken but then I can't get it to remove from this piece but I basically want this round piece so that I can put it on the uh, the back ladder of little blue over there I mean a little blue um good enough. So I'm getting that, and I'll be getting some lights, not from here, but I need some yellow ones. There may be some indoor lights, and I'm going to fix up the in interior. This is actually a, a newer model, Four Winds, in mine. I have, a, you know, my RV is a Four Winds. So this is one that's newer than mine that's been scrapped. Um, not very many matching components. You can see the door stuff on here is different, but if I can pull it, maybe I'll use it. I don't know if it locks, if it works. It probably doesn't work with it being like this. But I'm, I may be better off trying to find one that's um, similar. You know, they have different doors and different things. So, not the most scenic view, but actually um, could be beneficial to trying to get blue back together. I just pray that blue doesn't end up like one of these. Um, this is what happens to old RVs when... Um, they're no longer habitable. As you can see, they got wood in here you could use. I don't know. It's like wood and other stuff. I don't know, for building. But, um, yeah. And you can see even the attachment thing's different for uh, the different models. Maybe that's how mine used to be. But I don't know. I'm, I'm getting the other kind because it, it'll fit. Maybe it'll put off some light bulbs because I do need lights. These things are, like, expensive. They're, like, um two dollars two or three dollars for a pair of them so i'm gonna pull some of these to use them because i've got some burnt out lights and just have a spares um but basically and i don't pull too much because i don't really need too much blue is um uh, not blue um good enough is self-contained and functional right now it's hooked up to the air conditioning uh they're gonna try to back it in so they can hook it up to the septic and then um you know that's gonna be my home for a while i'm, I'm planning on battling down uh with a batten down um, also got a, f uh, starting my new year, I got another letter from the Department of Education going to garnish all my wages again. Yeah, so we're, we're beginning the cycle. You know, as soon as they learn that I have a job, they take my money. So being here, it's going to be tight. Um, it's one of the few places I could afford to pay for, but also long term. Um, instead of having to move all the time, I'm planning on staying here to ride out um, the COVID situation until I can um, try to retire in Thailand, if that's still even, you know, going to be an option. We're, we're still waiting for the world. So this is my world right now, and I know it looks bad, but I don't plan on hanging out here too much other than, you know, sleeping here and um, living here. Inside the RV, amazingly, it looks, you know, you don't see all this stuff. So it looks the same. So I'll be working on uh, fixing up the RV, um, I have components I can pull, which is really good. <laughs> the RV could end up being in better condition. I am probably going to try to rip up the interior floor again where there's a leak in the bathroom, you know, water squirting up or something, rotting the wood. And so that's going to be a big renovation project for the RV itself. So, you know, if you guys want to see that stuff, let me know. I will put that up. Um, but I'll be pulling, pulling things. I have parts, you know. RV parts are kind of hard to get unless you go to an RV store and they tend to charge a lot. But here, it's all over the place. <laughs> so, until next time, everyone, take care. God bless you all. Stay safe. Just wanted to give you a quick update and let you know I'm okay. 
uh, the view has certainly changed, but um, in, inside the RV, I have electricity to run the air conditioning. I will have water, you know, they're gonna hook the water so I can have water. Basically all the stuff that you would have at, at an RV spot, you know, water, sewage. Um, they also have Wi-Fi. It's not the best Wi-Fi, but at least I can watch some YouTube videos and stuff on it. don't think it's good enough to stream or broadcast, but good enough for watching some YouTube, doing some internet work. So uh, that'll leave my phone time free for using um, phone and live stream. So you might see more of those. So until next time, everyone, take care. God bless you all. Thank you for your continued support. I hope that 2021 is turning out well for you so far. And if it doesn't, um, it's okay. You still got a whole year for it to improve. So take care. God bless you all. Have a great day. Bye-bye now.